first, I didn't think it was ter too bad until he came running up the stairs to come in the house and I saw the skin peeling off of his hand immediately and he was in so much pain and pretty much just screaming because it hurt so bad. Yeah, I'm for, from Wake Forest. Yeah, I went to a Wake Forest Rosal, then I moved, and then I moved back. I went to Wakefield. Um, just went back out to relight it and hang out for a few before we had to make it, make our drive home. Buddy, of mine poured gas on it. Um, try to hopefully it we we get hot enough and we lit it for it to stay lit and um, not even thinking it would light. I went to go light it with my lighter and it exploded. I looked at my buddy and yelled his name and ran right immediately inside and I got under cold water to help to burn. Very, very bad, excruciating pain. Feels like razor blades are cutting you open. Um, very, very, very bad. I started feeling a lot of pain in my forearm. And I didn't feel none before, it was all in my hand. Um, so that was kind of scary. I thought that, you know, I'm going to have, I'm, something bad was going to happen where I'm going to end up losing a limb. It was so bad. Yeah, I mean, I'm getting better each day. The pain is, still there um it's just not as bad um certain times of day it gets uh worse when i'm changing or whatever um if i'm moving around or it you know it's bad but um each day is getting better uh skin graft surgery um take skin off of my legs and put it on my arm to reheal. I have no skin from here to here. Wow. And third degree burn right here, deep. Um, I'm not going to have full strength back in my hand for a very long time. Um, I'll have to wear sunscreen for a year. Um, can't be in direct sunlight for a long period of time. Um, it's just, I mean, it's gonna change me, that's for sure. I just thank God I'm alive. That it's not, it was, it's not, you know, it could be worse. I didn't realize how bad it was until I seen the actual burn doctor on Sunday, Sunday morning. And he told me what was gonna have to happen to make it better. Uh, what scared me the most is having nerve damage where I wouldn't be able to use my hand again. Yeah, we've talked since then. He's been checking on me and, and he's been worried about me. I mean, I've known him since the third grade, so he's worried too, just as much as everybody else is. Any hard feelings there? Um, no. It was, I mean, it's it just a mistake, accident, you know, accidents happen. It's not his fault. 